Hello everyone, I am Dr. Puru Dhawan and today we are going to discuss about hot water therapy for kidney patient. Is it really beneficial or is it silently harming the kidneys patient? We shall explore all this today. So let's begin now. So what happens when you sit in hot water for a few minutes? Your body starts sweating and most of the people think that by doing this, the collected waste in their body is getting removed and this is treating their kidneys. You must be knowing that in a kidney patient, the kidney can't filter the waste properly due to which waste like creatinine urea starts collecting in the body. This waste puts stress on the kidneys. But coming back to the hot water bath therapy, if you think that sitting in a hot water for a long time can treat your kidneys, then you are wrong. Why? Let's discuss the reason for this one by one. First, through sweat, your body removes a lot of waste, but sweat doesn't remove the main waste, creatinine. So even if you sweat a lot, the creatinine level in your blood are exactly the same as before. Moving further, Sweating causes loss of water and sodium from the body. This might provide temporary relief from the both swelling and high blood pressure. But the moment you eat any food high in salt or you have a lot of fluid intake, your body will again start showing issue like swelling and high blood pressure. Now moving further, when you expose your body to heat for a long time period, loss of appetite can occur. Slowly, the patient starts feeling weak as they are not having enough meal to keep their body strong for fighting kidney disease. Moreover, it can also cause nausea and vomiting, adding more discomfort. Now, the other important thing to be noted, the human skin allows a one-way passage. This means that certain things like sweat and toxin can come out of the body, but nothing goes inside the body through the skin. So even if you mix some herbs or medicines in the hot water, they will not enter your body through your skin. I hope this much is clear to you until now. Next, too much of sweating can cause dehydration in the patient's body. This put pressure on the already stressed kidney. And last but not least, hot water therapy is an external process which does not treat the main cause of the kidney disease. People feel better for a few hours and think their kidney are improving. They stop managing their blood pressure and blood glucose level, which might result in end-stage kidney disease or kidney failure. Why? Because the real reason of the kidney disease is still present inside the body and getting worse day by day. So after studying all the factors in detail, we can say that hot water bath therapy might give some temporary relief from some symptoms but it does not treat the kidney disease. And if overused, it can actually harm the patient. So it is my special advice to all my patients that instead of going for this therapy, focus on managing the real cause of the kidney damage, like controlling your blood pressure, blood sugar, or there can be any other reason also, such as kidney infection. Along with this, don't forget to follow a kidney-friendly diet and never skip your medicines. I hope this concept are clear to you. See you all in the next video. Till then, take care. Bye-bye and namaste.